Two and one. What? Where? Joel, two and one. Joel. Joel, yeah. Joel. I mean, I have it, say amen. I don't know, they don't even know what you did. Right after Damon. Joel, right? Mm-hmm. J O E L. Between Daniel and Hosea. I mean, yeah, Hosea and After Genesis and before. Right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. After Hosea. Joel 2 and 1. Blow ye the trumpet in Zion, and sound an alarm in my holy mountain. Let all the inhabitants of the land tremble, for the day <coughs> of the Lord cometh, for it is nigh at hand. Blow ye the trumpet of Zion. Amen. For the day of the Lord is nigh at hand. Yeah. He's coming. Amen. It says here in Joel in the Old Testament, He's coming. Amen. Blow the trumpet of Zion, for He's coming. Yeah. Tell everyone that he's coming. Amen. The day of the Lord is near. First Thessalonians 4, 16 through 17. First Thessalonians 4, 16 through 17. For the Lord himself shall descend from heaven with a shout, and the voice of the archangel, and with the trump of God, and the dead in Christ shall rise first. Then we which are alive and remain shall be caught up together with, him, with them in the clouds to meet the Lord in the air, and so shall we ever be with the Lord. He, it says here that he's coming. He's coming back. Amen. No doubt about it. He said he was coming back. Amen. The dead in Christ shall rise first, then we which are alive and remain shall be caught up together with them in the clouds to meet the Lord in the air, and so shall with and so shall we ever be with the Lord. We're gonna be with the Lord. Amen. On this day, first the dead in Christ, then, yeah. then we're gonna rise up into the clouds with them. Amen. We're, and we're going to be there through all eternity. Yeah. There is no end. We're going to be there. The day of the Lord is coming. Blow oh. ye the trumpet of Zion. Amen. In John 26 through 7, it says, Then cometh Simon Peter following him, and went into the sepulchre, and see if the linen clothes lie. And the napkin that was about his head, not lying with the linen clothes, clothes, but wrapped together in a place by itself. Now, the custom was the napkin would be <clears throat> folded if they were coming back. Yeah. But if they weren't coming back, they would just leave it there, yeah. not folded. But if they were coming back, it would be folded. He was coming back. Amen. He's coming back. Blow ye the trumpet of Zion. Amen. Sound the alarm. For the day of the Lord is not at hand. Amen. Acts 1.11 says, Which also said, Ye men of Galilee, why stand ye gazing up into heaven? This same Jesus, which is taken up from you come into on. heaven, shall so come in like manner as ye have seen him go into heaven. Amen. He's coming back in like manner as you have seen him go to heaven. Come on. He had said he was coming back. Yeah. The angels said he was coming back. Amen. If he said he was coming back, he has to come back. Amen. Amen. He does not lie. His word comes to pass. Come on. Amen. No man knows the day or the hour. Right. In first. 1 Thessalonians 5 and 2 says that he comes as a thief, a thief in the night. Yeah. It 
Fuck. For yourselves know perfectly that the day of the Lord so cometh as a thief in the night. Yeah. He will come as a thief in the night. If if you're not ready, come on. You're left behind. Amen. What? Where is that about? Is it the twelve twelve aversion virgins? Ten? Half of them didn't have oil for the lamp for their lamps. Amen. They weren't ready. Come on. They weren't ready. They were left behind while yeah. the other five were taken. Amen. They were left behind. Yeah. He's coming back. If Come you're on. not ready, you're staying. Amen. He was here 2,000 years ago. He's coming back. Nobody knows the hour. Come on. Nobody knows the minute, hour, day, year. Come on. Nothing. Amen. They don't know when he's coming back, but he's coming back because he said so. Amen. He said he was coming back. Nothing can stop that. Yeah. He's coming back. Amen. Give the Lord a hand clap. Praise the Lord. Amen.